of this Tower Hamlets is united. The mayor of Tower Hamlets has written to the university saying that people in Tower Hamlets are appalled that they should try and take away this valuable asset from Tower Hamlets because this is about education for working class people. It's no coincidence this university is situated here, one of the poorest working class communities in the country because it's all about providing opportunity for people from working class communities. It's about more than that as well. It's about education for everybody. It's about education that enriches people. It's about saying that art is part of the culture of all of us and that working class people are entitled to art as the rich and the famous. I want to say a bit about this protest because there have been a lot of attacks on people protesting lately. But I say to you this, the only way we can save this university is by protest, is by occupation, is by taking strike action. And that's the only way that working class people have achieved anything. If we have waited for the good, and the go the good people to write anything for us, we would never have had the vote. Working class people would never have had the vote. We wouldn't have trade unions. Everything that we've achieved has come from working class people standing up and fighting. And that is the tradition that you are in and you're proud. I would suggest to you that we block the road, but you couldn't really hold up the traffic any more than a road works around all gate at the moment. <laughs> but we do need to think about what protests we take. Direct action, strike action and support. And you are part of a mood in this country. A mood that says we're sick of seeing education sacrificed, a health sacrificed, a public service sacrificed, all on the altar of profit. I think the election of Jeremy Corbyn, the local MP and the other side, shows what people in this country want. We want an alternative. The last thing we're saying this, why is it? Why is it that you have to be standing outside here today trying to save a vital asset when at the same time this government is spending billions of pounds dropping bombs on Syria. If there's money to go around the world bombing people, there's money to keep universities open. There's money to provide a health service. There's money to provide decent public services. So my last thing is this, we need to link up together because with a wide mood, your fight is our support for us all, but we need to build a movement that's capable of winning an alternative that puts education, health, and the interest of working class people first. So good luck to you. We'll support you in every way you can. Fight them and beat them. Yeah.